I think the thing for me was that uh, I, I had converted to a catcher early when I signed with the Dodgers, and consequently it took me a few years really to learn the position. So once I kind of felt comfortable enough that I could catch in the big leagues, then then pretty much my confidence kicked in. And if you don't have confidence, there's, there's, you're not going to do much. So by the time I got to AAA, I was – I was pretty confident that I could be a pretty good hitter in the big leagues. And then I just needed the opportunity. And then the Dodgers called me up in 92 and they didn't resign Mike Sosha in 93. So, um, yeah, I had a great rookie year. And just after that, it was just off to the race. I think it was all of the above. I mean, uh, you, you as well know, I mean, my strength is spraying the ball all over the field, especially to the right center field gap, and not just home runs, but base hits and doubles and, and hitting that ball off the wall. And for me, it was letting the ball get deep, not not trying to do too much. I think we all get into problems when we sort of get pull happy and that left shoulder as a, as a right-handed hitter starts to fly open and you start coming around the ball a little bit. and You just have to take your hits. You know, in, in broken bat hits, and those things are great, too. And take your walks, try to command the strike zone, and never lose your, your knowledge of the strike zone. Try not to go fishing. Put the ball in play, man. Like, you might, out of 20 balls you put in play, you might get three or four hits. And it's just, I like getting on base. I hated striking out. And that was just, that was the school that I learned from. 